For cheap Ultimate Team Coins, go and check out ufifa.com and use my discount code EGHD at the checkout to get 5% off your order. What's up guys, Jack here and welcome back to a brand new series. Well, I say brand new series, it's kind of uh, an old series I'm bringing back and I've changed the rules up a little bit. And you guys used to love it, you guys always went ham with the likes on it and it was a series which gave a lot back to you as a viewer. So the idea of the series, or the name of the series I should say, is FIFA Snap and you should be seeing some rules on the screen right now of uh, what I've changed. Basically it's basically like higher or lower, it's the card game like higher or lower but with FIFA packs. So if I open a pack, um, which is for you by the way, and you get an 81 rated player, I will say do you want to play higher or lower and in the next pack you have to you know get it correct and if you're wrong you're out and if you're correct your tally will go up now as you can see at the bottom of the screen i've now calculated something where it's like if you get five in a row you win 50,000 coins if you get nine in a row you get 250,000 coins and if you get 13 correct higher or lower in a row you'll win 1 million coins and if you're wondering how do you get involved in this kind of series all you got to do is follow me on twitter i will literally just tweet out favorite this if you want to get involved and i'll pick maybe three to five people per episode on youtube and i also do this when i live stream which is you know on the odd occasion but I still do it when I live stream so if you want to do that make sure you uh, follow me on uh, Twitch TV as well so guys what you should be seeing on your screen right now is obviously on the left hand side you should be seeing the FIFA 15 screen underneath me is my Twitter DM conversation with the person that's playing my contestant basically and also obviously me in the top right hand corner but right at the bottom you should see the graph of where they currently are so they, they won't have any packs at the moment because we haven't opened any so let's get into this if you do want to see this series you know continually once a week maybe two times a week Hit a like on this video and if you don't enjoy the series or there's something you don't like about it or maybe there's other ways to improve it, drop it in the comments as well. So we've got someone on Twitter ready to go. I'm going to open up his first pack, tell him what gets inside and he's got to decide whether he wants to play higher or lower. So this pack's opening right now and he has got a 76 rated, although there could be a non-rare which is higher rated. So let's have a look. Yes, there is. So it's a 78, Jao I, I absolutely kill uh, Spanish names. So guys, what happens now is I send this person a message. I ask him, do they want to keep playing? If, if so, do you want to play higher or do you want to play lower or you can decide to keep the pack if it's, if it's a really good pack and you want to keep it it's worth a little bit of coins but in this situation the pack is pretty much discard value so he said he wants to play higher so in this pack he needs a 78 or above and there you go he has a 79 rated player which is his uh, rare player so it's definitely the highest rated and uh, yeah so he's still in the game he's got one tally already if he gets to five he will win 50,000 coins and etc nine and 13 so guys you're probably getting the hang of the series already but I've asked him again does he want to play higher or lower he says he wants to keep playing and also in that message I sent him I put in brackets one because he's got one in a row so far and he wants to continue playing he wants to play higher so guys in this pack he needs a 79 or better if the pack actually loads EA's been a little bit slow for me but here we go and he's got 79 rated again, something I haven't actually told you guys yet in this video is if you get the same rated player, whether you say higher or lower, you always go through. So if you get a tie, it's okay. So guys, as you can see, Emilio said he wants to play lower on this one. This is for three in a row, and he has got it correct. What a legend, what an absolute G. Personally myself, I would have played higher because 79 isn't exactly a high rating, but he's got it correct. Next one is going to be 77. For four in a row, he has said he wants to play higher and he is correct. He's gone 82 rated Dante and he's also got Fernando Torres as well. Not a bad pack actually. So because it's the first time I've actually used these series rules, I'm going to quickly explain to you the situation. He's got four in a row correct so far and he says he wants to play lower on the next pack. If he gets it correct, he wins himself 50,000 coins, but he can still lose that if he does something stupid. It's kind of like who wants to be a millionaire? You hit checkpoints, you can keep going, and you can take that, that, you can go down to that checkpoint or you can keep going up to the next checkpoint if that makes sense. So for 50,000 coins, is Emilio a winner today? He needs lower and he is correct by the looks of it. 66 rated there and his highest rated is Yilmaz who is 77 rated. So that's 50,000 coin checkpoint for him. So guys, as you can see, I told him the pack that he got. I said you can keep the pack plus 50,000 coins with this checkpoint or you can play higher or lower. If you get it higher or lower wrong, you'll be out the game. You will lose all the 50,000 coins. And uh, he said he wants to keep the pack. So this person has won 50,000 coins and we will be on to the next person. So guys, we are back with round or contestant number two. We have someone here called Mike and he is ready to play. So we're going to open up his first pack live. Let's see what he gets in his first pack. If he gets a legend, I'm going to be so mad. But that's the beauty of this series. You can get some amazing players and you can also lose out on some amazing players. It's all about how you play it. So Mike's replied and he says he wants to play higher. He said he hopes that my pack luck is good. But as you guys know, it's not particularly the greatest, but... You never know, it could just happen today, he could get a legend. Oh, and what, what the hell? He literally got back to back, de-sanctus. 
That is very, very strange. So he did get back-to-back -back DeSantis, but I don't want to confuse him. I'm going to tell him that he got this player as his highest rated player. Otherwise, he'd be like, what? Wait, you just told me that player. So obviously, I got the same rated player. He's going to go higher again. And um, it looks like he could be out unless there's a non-rare in this pack that is higher than 79. And it's he's, he's basically out, guys. This is what happens. This is what the series is like. You've got to guess correctly. He's got two 77s and a 75. He said higher, it's not, so you're out the game. So guys, round number three, or the third person for today, is going to be Matthew is Beast. That's his name. We're going to see if we can pack him something nice along the way, or he can get like 13 in a row and win himself 1 million coins. Let's see what he does in the first pack. Rodriguez, that's not a bad way to start your pack opening. 76 is the highest, but... This guy here, non-rare, 79, a Freddie Mercury lookalike is going to be his absolute highest. So for the first one, Matthew says he wants to play lower and it looks like he is correct unless there is a super rare, sorry, super high rated non-rare player and he is correct. He's got 76 rated here, Fernandez. So of course, Matthew said he wants to play higher. 76 is pretty much one of the lowest ratings you can get and he's definitely through with that. 77 rating, still keeping it quite low. So um, to go higher again is quite a safe bet. So as expected, Matthew does say higher. Let's see what he gets in his pack and he gets 82 Mandanda, which is uh, it's actually going to be quite tough to see if he goes higher or lower in this situation. I'd imagine lower. This is for Matthew's fourth in a row pack. He says lower. Does he get lower? Yes, he does, because that means there's no rare players in his pack, and he's got 77 rated. Okay, so this one is going to be for 50,000 coins, five in a row. He says higher. Does he get higher? No, he gets a tie, which is 77 rated uh, downing. So he has technically won himself 50,000 coins if he wants to take it right now, or he can take it next pack or the pack after until he gets to nine and he could win himself 250,000 coins. Let's see what he wants to do. So as you can see, Matt has decided to go higher and he is correct. He's got a 79 rated player here and he is on his six in a row. He could be winning himself 250k at this rate. So guys, as you can see, Matt says he wants to keep this pack, which means he's keeping the 50,000 coins plus the 5,000 coins. I'm gonna be generous. I'm gonna say this pack's probably worth about 5,000 coins, which means we've got two winners today, 50,000 coins each and one loser. If you're interested in getting involved in this series, make sure you do follow me at ezekuen7. My Twitter will be in the description. Very simple to get involved. And uh, that's pretty much it. And also, if you want to see this series continue, let's see if we can smash 10,000 likes as well. Make sure to subscribe to me, Ezekiel Gaming HD, and I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.